This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Well, it is a stadium that absolutely oozes history. Here we are at the San Siro in Milan. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League semi-final first leg action coming right up for you. It's Milan up against Inter. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Team. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. Sandro Tonali plays alongside Ismael Benasser in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. Starting lineup: Francesco Acerbi plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. Ben Asser. Can they create something from here? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Sandro Tonali. It's with Giroud. Hernandez. Terrific block. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Oh, can he score here, Derek? Plenty of support here. Into the centre from Mkhitaryan. The save was a good one. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Krunic. Diaz. Zero! And the keeper more than equal to the task. Leao. Oh, big opportunity! Well, the Milan fans can sense a goal coming here. They're certainly creating some good opportunities now. And attempting the through ball. Will he? And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Playing it in. Struggling to get it away. Mkhitaryan, just the challenge that was required. Radek Krunic. 
The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. And he might be through here. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. And the short option preferred. Tomori. Diaz. Can he give them the lead? Well, he had to read it and get there, and did. Mkhitaryan. It's with Chalhanolu. Given away by Inter. Teo Hernandez oh the threat is there he's got the right idea with that pass oh he couldn't outwit the keeper can he deliver it with accuracy not quite the clearance they were hoping for Diaz can he take advantage and danger still, and a goal! The opener in the semi-final, first goal of the contest! Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one, but they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. to restart the game it's going to be interesting to see how they reply to that setback Davide Calabria interception to snuff out the danger Giroud Leal opportunity here oh that's a fine save And he's fired over the corner. Still not clear. Diaz. Well, capable of so much better, to be honest. Well, I expected more as well, Derek. I thought from that sort of position, he had every chance of scoring. But it's a poor effort. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, as they say in French, Olivier Giroud has that savoir-faire. He knows what he's doing in this one, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Mkhitaryan... Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Now veering in field. Opportunity! Oh, good work by the keeper. Let's see about the delivery. An alert piece of defending. Diaz. And it's still on. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And deciding to go short with this one. 
Now a corner right on the back of the last one. Over it comes. Attending to his defensive chores. Cutting infield here. Can't miss, surely. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Now a set piece coming up for Milan. And maybe an opportunity for them to increase their advantage. Grunic. No problems for the keeper. Varela. The ball with Martinez. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Rafael Leao, good tackle, it'll be a throw. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Rade Krunic. Canabria. Aimed towards Ibrahimovic, far post there. But keeper's ball, they'll be disappointed with that delivery. Jekko. Effective challenge. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. They're making high pressing work for them here. Rade Krunic. Going to get a try. And the keeper had the measure of it. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Now sending it in. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Dumfries. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? This could level it. In it goes! How about that for late excitement? Inter have leveled it. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Rafael Leao. Milan still going forward as the minutes tick away. Even Steven. Intercepting it intelligently. Five minutes left. To Kate Delare. Did well to win the ball back. Martinez. Jekko. Jekko, chance! Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Sandro Tonali. Not to be advised, giving the... And there's the final whistle. A thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, he had a good game and certainly had an impact. They may have struggled to get a draw without him today, 